Hi there. So if you're trying to set up a password for your Zoom meeting, just to instill an extra level of security, the easiest way to do that is when you schedule that new meeting, and you of course can do that by going to this blue button here on your home screen for Zoom. So you click on that and that brings up this box up at the top. Of course, you've got your topic. You might want to set up the meeting for the 3rd of April at say 12.30 in the afternoon, just for half an hour. You can see here that your meeting ID is generated automatically. Um, and to set up the password, all you do is you click on this little box here and your six digit password is automatically generated. So when you click schedule, what then happens is in your meeting invite, so I have my Zoom account linked to my Outlook diary, you can see here that within that, the password is now embedded in your meeting invite. So people can go into your meeting invite and that's where they will find the password for your meeting. Now sometimes I find it useful to actually add something into the subject line just to tell people that there is a password for the meeting. Otherwise, you will invariably have at least one person who sends you a message saying that they can't get the Zoom link to work and it's asking them for a password and they don't necessarily know to go and look for it within your meeting invite. So that's the easiest way to do it. But if you decide that you always want to have a password set up for all of your meetings, you can play with the settings within your Zoom account. And the way to do that is you go over here to the top right hand corner of your Zoom home, home screen for the app. And you can see there is a little cog, you click on that. And that brings up this box here, which is the, the upper level of your settings. Now, unfortunately, Zoom hasn't included your passwords or anything like that in this particular list here. And so what you need to do is you need to click on view advanced features and that will then take you into the website for Zoom. OK, so this is if you're going to Zoom online, this is where you have all of your settings, etc. You have your profile and all those different things you can play with. Now, in this screen here, if you scroll down, you'll find that there's a whole load of different options for passwords within it. OK, so what you can do here is if you want to require a password when scheduling new meetings and you want that to be a default or automatic setting, you just click that on like this. Now, annoyingly, what then happens is when you go into schedule a new meeting, so if you go straight back into this app again and schedule a meeting, you'll see that that setting hasn't actually uh, flowed through into your actual working bit of Zoom. And so what you need to do is you need to sign out from your account. You then need to log in again. So I'm just typing in my password now off the screen so you can't see it. And so now when I go into this and I schedule a meeting, you'll see that that new setting has flowed through and that the password box or button was automatically clicked. And so that means that if you're setting up a, a meeting very quickly, then it, is, it automatically flows through. Now, if I just go back to into my Zoom settings again, you can see that there are a number of options. So requiring a password when scheduling new meetings, that's usually a good idea. Also as well, say for example, you've got an instant meeting. So that's one where when you're going into your app, you just click on this new meeting. And so that will bring up a meeting automatically and you usually then send on the URL or the link to the people that you want to join that meeting. Um, so do you want a password set for those meetings, for example? And so there's a number of different options here that you can play with, reg with regards to actually what you want to set up. So I hope that helps you with regards to setting up passwords for your Zoom meetings. I suspect it's going to become more and more usual as we go into the future. Thanks.